But until I'm in the ring with Floyd Mayweather Jr., I'm not gonna believe that I'm fighting. Puerto Rico's Department of Natural and Environmental Resources are investigating a video of YouTube stars Jake and Logan Paul that showed them speeding along the sand in the motorized vehicle, which is prohibited in order to protect Puerto Rico's wildlife. So today we're gonna to be talking about the top 10 facts about Logan Paul on the run from Puerto Rico government. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Make sure you stay until number one, cause you don't wanna miss all this stuff going on with Logan Paul and his response to the controversy, who is also an avid animal lover. One night, got your hat. Number 10, Logan Paul and his upcoming match. The YouTube star is about to get into the ring with retired national champion boxer Floyd Mayweather in what is called a publicity fight. Reports are that Mayweather will make a $10 million guarantee just for walking into the ring at Hard Rock Stadium in Miami, and his opponent, Logan Paul, will get $250,000 for being in attendance and 10% of the pay-per-view box office for his efforts. Dinner tonight. Someone just won the car in Colorado, right? Yeah, that's what we're here. We're delivering it to Joseph. So you should deliver it to me. <laughs> <laughs> Number nine. Why did Logan Paul move to Puerto Rico? The 26-year-old Logan Paul has been determined to prove himself as more than just a social media mogul, so much so that he left his LA lifestyle and moved out to the island in March to focus on his training. Number eight. Puerto Rico. Heaven on earth for Logan Paul. Logan Paul moved his myriad of media and fashion businesses, including Maverick Clothing from Southern California to Dorado, Puerto Rico. The town is the preferred settlement for wealthy expats who mostly live inside the luxurious Dorado Beach. Paul and his brother Jake allegedly settled for a $10 million beachfront mansion inside the beach, which the YouTuber called heaven on earth. But until I'm in the ring, Junior, I'm not gonna believe that I'm fighting. Number seven, Puerto Rico and its policies. Puerto Rico has a series of business-friendly policies and laws which allows foreign individuals to pay close to no income tax by living in Puerto Rico. Jake Paul and his brother Logan Paul have seized upon the opportunity to pack their bags and create their own fantasy life full of fast money and indulgent thrills. Number six, Puerto Rico's environmental laws. So Puerto Rican beaches are known to be nesting spots for sea turtles between February and August. Sea turtles are an endangered species and so driving or any other activity is prohibited by law here to protect the environment and the species that live on the beaches. I, Logan Paul, will knock out, defeat, and embarrass Floyd Mayweather. Number five, reason for the investigation. Jake Paul is under investigation by officials in Puerto Rico when he took to Instagram sharing a short video that showed him speeding along the sand in a motorized vehicle, which is prohibited in order to protect local wildlife. Now, TMZ reporting that Paul's famous brother, Logan, may have been riding in a second golf cart seen in the clip. Number four, the petition calling to charge the Pauls with a crime. A petition urging the Puerto Rican government to charge controversial YouTubers Jake and Logan Paul with a crime is over 70,000 signatures. The video was widely criticized for reckless behavior. Given the YouTuber's internet popularity is it's especially important, he's held accountable for this action, the petition statement reads. I'm taking this man down. <laughs> Number three, action by the Puerto Rico government. After the video of Paul and his entourage driving on the beach was Widely shared, Puerto Rico's Secretary of the Department of Natural and Environmental Resources released a statement regarding the video saying, I have ordered an investigation to determine the circumstances surrounding the use of two motor vehicles on beaches that are presumed to be in Puerto Rico, Rafael Machargo wrote. One less wins than him and also absolutely nothing to lose against a guy who's got literally everything to lose. Number two, Logan's response on the controversy. Well, according to Def Noodles, an influencer watchdog account on social media, Logan responded to the controversy in a restricted post through his Maverick Club network. I don't feel like making a big deal out of this on my public socials, Logan wrote. I'm so tired of the media and ignorant, angry losers trying to pick on Jake and I. Jake got backlash for legally driving a legal electric golf cart on a private beach here in Dorado. I love you guys. Thank you for sponsoring me for this fight. Back to the video. Time to make this wait. Number one, solution to the controversy. 
Logan Paul has also confirmed now that he is an animal lover and was not aware of the nesting turtles and planned to cooperate with authorities for any investigation. Hey, while you're here, go ahead, click one of these two videos on your screen. We'll see you there.